These golf clubs are not for the faint-hearted, and you've been desperate for them for ages. Beat me and you can keep them. Ooh. Should we do Challenge it? Challenge accepted. I'm playing off 12 these days. You're not off 12. Let me see how the first shot goes. Ooh! Ow! Ouch! Oh yeah! This is why there is a lesson here for everyone. Blades aren't for everybody. So do you want a shot here, yeah? Yep. Oh, you're so boring. That was a great strike for the first of the day. Hoo -hoo! So guys, that is right. In today's video, I'm taking on Liam. Liam, what handicap are you? Ten. Ten handicap. He's been desperate to get some blades in the bag for quite some time. So much so, if he can beat me today, I'm going to give him these Mizuno MP20 MBs. Can he beat me? Should he be using them? Get in the comments below and let me know what you think. Should he be using um, them? Right, mate, not the best start for you uh, in with the squirrels. Liam, talk to me about why you want these bladed clubs in your golf bag. When I played golf about three years ago, James, yeah. I really enjoyed hitting them. And you were desperate for them. You're still desperate for them. No, I was desperate for them. Let's have a look at the irons in question because people haven't really seen, had a good look at them. These look absolutely beautiful. And I used them for quite a while. They should be in your specs, Mate. Um, but there's not a lot of forgiveness there. Was that a four iron off the first two? No, mm. five. Well, uh, not the best shot you've ever hit. I'm out in the fairway, uh, just over there. There's a tree in the way. I'll get shot here though. Yeah? Yeah. I don't want to hit that. That could hurt. They look too nice for my bag. Yeah, they do look a bit nice and shiny, don't they? Can't believe how much you've gotten away with that. Oh. Yeah, not bad. It's just running down there somewhere. There for one, as they say, in the handicap terms. <laughs> Go! Oh, annoyingly, I've got half a set and that was the wedge that I didn't have that I needed. Right mate, you've actually gotten away with that quite well and mine's finished just short as well. What have you got here? Have you got a proper wedge? Uh, yeah. Fancy a little bump and run with the pitching wedge? No. Oh, I didn't really want to give you a free set of golf clubs, if I'm being brutally honest. <laughs> Great <laughs> shot. <laughs> Two gimmies? No, mate, because then you win the hole. Oh. This to go one up after that nightmare on the tee. Well, it wasn't a nightmare, it was in play. Of course, knowledge, pal. At least it wasn't an unmentionable. Almost. Steady four. I'll get yours for you, mate. Cheers, mate. Thank you. <laughs> oh, dear. One down. Right, rather annoyingly, that is one down. I suppose that is what happens when you let someone make up the handicap on the first tee and decide that he's getting a shot on the opening hole. Guys, stay tuned. Who's going to win? Is he going to win a full set of... Rather annoying. I could have sold them for like four or five hundred quid. Oh, I will sell them. <laughs> <laughs> right, second hole. No shots here. What are you going with? Four iron. Let's have a look at this. Tiny. Did you swear? I didn't know if you swear. Yeah, I did. Um, quite a short blade length, quite a thin top line. I don't think this goes past 130 yards. What do you think, John? I fancy him for it. Do you? Yeah. See? He, f he gave me the putt on the first as well. He knows I'm a good golfer. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's recreate that swing off the first. Ooh! Everything's a bit bright. That's literally come out like a nine iron. Oh, I, I'm not sure you... It's bounced. <laughs> it's bounced. <laughs> it's bounced. It's on the tree edge. I'll tell you what, based on the first hole, I bet that's a four in that hole. There's your tea, pal. Thank you again. Cheers, mate. No, not you. Right, come on. Get back level. Uh-oh. That is perfect. Perfect. In the bunker. That is perfect. That's left of the bunker. You seen anything? What's he on about? It went, it went in like there. It, says it didn't hit the tree. It bounced. I mean, the, the, the ratio of fairways hit to shots isn't that good. Mate, on the first, mate. <laughs> Get it away. 
Right. What are we going with here? You could really just do with maybe like a cavity iron for just a shot out of the rough, I think, more than more than anything. A skillful player like myself. John's brave. Yeah, John's not safe there. Struck it well. Get over the ditch. Oh, that's never a good sign. Yeah. It has got over the ditch, not bad. Horrible little chip you've left yourself, but... Player with my experience, no James. No doubt there'll be another four, mate, won't it? Yeah, up and down, again. Oh, sit down. Be the club. Go! Sit down. Oh, it's good. Oh, oh that's delightful. Come on! Good shot, James. Perfect. He's not having those clubs for free. Well, the fairway stats and green stats in regulation are looking good, mate. Whose? Yours. Oh. You two won't. missed fairways, two missed greens. Yep. One par. <laughs> This is a tough one. Oh, it's a shame. It's a shame, but the good news is you'll get another go at it. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Still you, mate. Is that gonna hit my bag? Do you wanna have a go first, mate, so I don't embarrass myself too much? Yeah. Oh, you've got two for it, haven't you? Yeah. I'll make a decision after this, I think. On what? You wouldn't want to race it past? No, mate, definitely not. Definitely but you wouldn't want to leave not. a birdie putt short? No, I think just, just nestle it in the right-hand side of the hole would probably do. About there. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! Go on, mate, have a putt. <laughs> Will I? <laughs> What's this for? Is this for a five? Yeah. No. Hmm. <laughs> <She'll go in. laughs> Back to level. It all comes down to this. Par three. 150 yards. What are you going with? Four, five? The way you delivered that loft on the last tee, I think you could maybe hit six. Doesn't need to be like that, is it, pal? <laughs> so just tell the people why you're thinking about maybe going for a set of fairly sexy irons, but Lacking forgiveness. I liked them when I uh, played about three years ago, and I've been badgering you, you, play, badgering you back then. Yeah, you play more for fun anyway, don't you? I do now. Are you really bothered about forgiveness or anything like that? No, just having a laugh, aren't we? Right, he's eating seven here. Yeah. Oh dear, that's a lot of club, that mate. I'll let you go first. Oh, it's my honour, isn't it? Your honour, pal. Sit. Sit! Oh, that is going to be a very difficult shot. What that, have you hit? I've tried to chip a six and absolutely nailed it. The door is ajar. Nah, mate, you're safe. I think it's more than ajar. You're safe, pal. Them people down there aren't. Even this looks tiny. Look at the blades, mate. I'm not that good anymore. Anymore? Oh. 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 <laughs> me. Fair to say, if this is a social experiment, how do you think it's gone? This is how I played the other week, to be fair, so. <laughs> I'm not so sure Liam should be winning these clubs anyway. Maybe we'll look at something a bit more forgiving for you, mate. Yeah, where's Foxy's irons? <laughs> yeah, good point, yeah. All right down there, pal. Oh. <laughs> what a shot. Thanks for giving me a chance, pal. That was always going to happen, wasn't it? No pressure. Oh, win these irons, sell them for 500 quid. I'm laughing. <laughs> and we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> what a...